squad is favorite auntie with uncle tendencies check it out y'all i don't know if y'all saw it. It, it the news snuck in on me so i wanted to share it with y'all just in case y'all hadn't see, seen it but the 2024 slam high school girls all-american team that uh, was officially announced today so i wanted to let y'all know who that was um because I, I didn't i didn't see a real official announcement of it i just i just kind of saw it just kind of pop up a little bit so i wanted to make sure that i shared that with everybody First up on the team, y'all, we got Sarah Strong, 6'2 forward out of North Carolina, Grace Christian School, committed to UConn, Kiyomi McMiller, 5'9 point guard out of New Jersey, Life Center Academy, committed to Rutgers, Jelani Cambridge, 5'6 point guard out of Tennessee, committed to The Ohio State University, Joyce Edwards, 6'3 forward out of South Carolina, committed to South Carolina, I should have said The South Carolina. Uh, and Katarina Koval, 6'5 forward out of Ukraine, going to University of Notre Dame. All of these ladies are going to have a tremendous impact on the schools that they are attending. I am here to watch them all. Uh, y'all yeah, know I, I've talked already about Sarah. I think UConn is a perfect fit for her. She'll definitely have a chance to play um, and compete at a high level. I expect them to be uh, competing for a for, uh, national championship next year. Uh, next season, if everybody's healthy, Kimmy McMiller at Rutgers will definitely go there and make a name for herself. Um, I think that she's a good piece to, to add there, but also to build around as they continue to build that program out. I expect Rutgers to make uh, some noise next season. Uh, Jelani Cambridge, uh, The Ohio State University, Big Ten, should be over there with Cody McMahon. Um, interesting to see what she's going to do. You got Juju on the beat coming in. Deja now has introduced herself to the Big Ten via Oregon. So, Gonna be a lot. Gonna be a lot of fun matchups to watch. Gonna definitely be watching a lot of more more Big Ten games uh, next season. Joyce Edwards, of course, I'm, I'm I'm here for it. Most versatile player, number one recruit to me coming into coming into college hoops next season. Excited to see uh, how we use her in South Carolina and how how quickly um, she's able to to adapt and, and put her full skill set to use for us. So excited to see what she's gonna do. And then uh, Katarina Koval, <clears throat> she's gonna be at Notre Dame with uh, Hannah Dalgo. And I, I, I leave the hill off on purpose. I know it's Hannah Hood Doggo, but she's all dog and all go. Let's go. Hannah Doggo. She's going to be down there with Hannah Doggo. Citron, Olivia is back. Uh, Co Co Coach Ivy. Coach Ivy got a nice got a nice team. Um, of course, been building a nice program. So excited to see what all of these new freshmen are going to be bringing. Uh, so we got a new set of freshmen coming in. New set of phenomenal freshmen coming in. Still going to be watching these sensational sophomores that we got, as well as the rest of the uh, the young ladies that are I'm finishing their, their collegiate career, but y'all know I've been really focused on the freshmen and the sophomores. So, looking forward to see how everybody matches up. A lot of movement going on. Just wanted to make sure everybody knew that the uh, Slam High School All-American team had been announced to share the Joyce had had, of course, another uh, accolade to, to her shelf. And uh, congratulations to all of these ladies. Looking forward to what they do uh, next season, and uh, we we here for it. So, come on over to SS Talk Sports, y'all. Hit that, hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell. Hit the like button. Share the conversation, y'all. Grow the conversation. Each one invite one. Let's double this thing up. It's your favorite night, too, with Uncle Tennessee. Until next time, y'all, stay tuned. Talk soon. I'm out.